And as we all know, we are facing an affordable housing crisis here in Montgomery County. At the same time, we have houses of worship in our community that find themselves with an oversupply of land, or as they like to say, they're land rich at the moment. And currently, these institutions face too many barriers to easily put their land to use to support their mission and our broader community. This amendment to the Montgomery County Zoning Ordinance will do two things. One, it will allow for, for multifamily housing and townhomes to be built in areas that are currently zoned only to permit residential detached homes. And it will also require affordability um, guide, guidelines for that they need to follow in order to uh, build this housing. If we want to have the type of welcoming and inclusive community that we talk about, that doesn't happen by chance, it happens by choice. Choices like the one we are making today to make it easier for our partners in the community who want to help us solve some of the most vexing challenges that we have, to be able to do it in an easier way, to make that process just a little bit faster, just a little bit cheaper, just a little bit easier. It has been proven that affordable housing is one of the ways for a family to get out of poverty, bring stability to a family, build generational wealth, and leave a legacy for succeeding generations. For far too long, zoning rules have separated people from the places that are important to them, such as their place of worship, and have separated people from each other. It's no wonder we're facing a crisis of community and loneliness at the same time that we're facing this housing crisis. This is not just a moral imperative, it's an economic necessity to be able to have the type of workforce in Montgomery County that we want and that we know that we need. 